all I'm going to do is reiterate part of my statement that I published yesterday um, and uh, give you a little bit of an update of where things stand. Um, I do not believe that heavy drinking or even loudish behavior of an 18 or even 21 year old should condemn a person for the rest of his life. I would be a hypocrite to think so. However, I have direct, repeated knowledge about Brett's drinking and his disposition while drunk. And I do believe that Brett's actions as a 53-year-old federal judge matter. If he lied about his past actions on national television, and more especially while speaking under oath in front of the United States Senate, I believe those lies should have consequences. It is truth that is at stake, and I believe that the ability to speak the truth even when it does not reflect well upon oneself, is a paramount quality we seek in our nation's most powerful judges. I can unequivocally say that in denying the possibility that he ever blacked out from drinking and in downplaying the degree and frequency of his drinking, Brett has not told the truth. I felt it was my civic duty to tell of my experience while drinking with Brett, and I offer this statement to the press. I have no desire to speak further publicly and nothing more to say to the press at this time. I will, however, take my information to the FBI. And on that note, I contacted the FBI, contacted me this morning. I contacted them. I've received the form. I filled it out with the details, but I can't give those to anybody right now. Thank you very you much. Know, her roommate said he never saw him black out. He, he was with him when he got home at night. You saw him when he woke up. Your response to that? Uh, I unfortunately believe that um, my, old, my probably now ex-friend is, is lying. Could you restate your first sentence again? I'm having a problem on the microphone there. My first sentence? Yeah, like the first two sentences. I do not believe that heavy drinking or even loudish behavior of an 18 or, or even 21 year old should condemn a person for the rest of his life. I would be a hypocrite to think so. What specifically did he testify to that you believe is a lie? I have seen Brett drunk to the point he could easily be passed out. But you never saw him passed out? No, I never saw him passed out, but I saw him quite drunk. He saw me quite drunk. And he, he testified that he did drink and wasn't proud of everything. He did, but he also downplayed to a great degree, the possibility that he could ever not know what was going on. So you're saying there were omissions? I'm saying there were omissions. There were certainly many times when he could not remember what was going on. Has anyone at the FBI actually told you they want to hear from you? 